You busy during the campaign, I want you to come around with me. <laughs> I, I want to be absolutely clear, as the leader of our party, I'm proud to tell people today that we value the work that's done by the public and sector employees in this province. <laughs> I don't buy the fetish with privatization that the Premier seems to have latched onto. As others have said, there's nothing new about it, there's nothing innovative about it. All you have to do is look at the case of Arthur Porter in Quebec and say, how has privatization worked out for them in the province of Quebec? Look at the hospital in Brampton that the Auditor General said cost two hundred million dollars more through privatization yep. than it would have been done if they'd done it yep. through the normal public investment <laughs> in health, in, in, in uh, public infrastructure. Yeah. Yeah. For one thing, capital costs way more for a private sector to raise than it does for government to raise That's because right. of the sheer size of government. But in any event, last week, the, the budget and the accompanying announcements in the last week or ten days have been an, an admission of failure by the current administration in their running of our financial affairs over the last 10 or 12 years. With all that wealth from oil, they're in the dying days of their administration coming in and admitting that they've made, they've made a hash of it, and then bringing in drastic changes to policy. A government in its dying days has no business implementing that kind of change without going to the people first. Yeah.